Hello, welcome to a new, new game. Uh, I'm playing a CTM map. It's called Diversity. Uh, unlike normal CTM maps, um, this map is based on the different kinds of Minecraft maps out there. Uh, adventure, CTM, that kind of stuff. Uh, I am your... Uh, don't want that. I am your Pop-Tart. Uh, now the door is closed. Um, I think this is a trapped chest. Yep. Okay. Recommended guides. Recommended haters guide. No, we we'll read both. Um, you feel free to pause this. I'm going to read this myself. Hmm, okay. Um, select easy. Uh, select easy, then do not change it. Um, mm -hmm. okay, done with that. Mm. Oh, okay, so they're basically the same thing. Okay. Alright, well, in we go. Uh, so, unlike normal CTM maps, which you've seen me play a little bit before, oops, um, I, I place it in the chest here, and things will be explained when I put in this white wool. Insert the wool into the chest. Now because this is the introduction, um, this piece of gravel should pop out. Let's analyze properly. Um, the redstone required to do that is just the same as the item sorter that uh, uh, the redstone item sorter that I'm designing. Um, anyways, shall we go? Uh, I don't really know what order I'm going to be doing these in. Um, I know I'm going to be doing the boss battle last. Uh, this is survival, labyrinthian, parkour, arena, puzzle, dropper, escape, trivia, and adventure. I think I'm going to do the boss battle and the adventure last. Uh, I'm not very good at parkour. Um. Uh. Ooh, hang on, just a second. Okay. Uh, just a short interval there. Um. I think I'm gonna start with puzzles. Um, okay. Um. See, return to hub. Uh, there's a bunch of buttons. Do these buttons do anything? Oh, no, I don't think so. Oh, I got a bunch of records. Um, okay, that's a two. Put that there. It's a three. Give me that. So, it's doing. Uh, I'll throw that over here so I don't get things confused. I think the elevator music. Where'd it go? Oh, over here. Lighting glitch. Let me glitch that. Um, that's a one. So I only have a few more options left here. That's a one as well. 
How can they both be a one? Unless this isn't actually a one. No, that says one as well. That's weird. So there's two options for one. This is a five. Nothing there. I'm trying to get a four. Aha! Four. This is four. Okay, so the code is black, I don't know, blue? Black, blue, white, no, purple. So this is black, purple, white, blue, red. There's no black, no red, so orange. Um, black, purple, white, blue, orange. Hooray! Black, purple, white, blue, orange. Okay. Um, that's good to know. Uh, let's see, what does this one do? Turns on three... No, turns on one, four, and seven. Okay. So if I click this, I'll turn off. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna need a piece of paper for this. I'll just open a notepad. Um, black equals one, four, seven. Purple. One, two, and six. Hmm. Okay. Flip that off. What does this one do? Does this one do anything? Oop, something burned. Okay, so I guess white should be the last. Well, in this case, it's a metal block. Um, we'll just write that off as last. Uh, that's three, five, and six. Three, five, and six, which means orange. Well, actually, that doesn't mean anything. Orange is two, four, seven. It's two, four, seven. So I assume I just need to get all these on. Uh, and push the middle one last. So, if I press black, um, orange, blue, purple, I should wait. I just saw something in there. Did we get something? Did I complete the puzzle? Um, no. Um, okay, all these are on except for one now. Um, if I click purple, and then orange, now I need four, six, and seven, so if I click black and blue, one, three, five, Wait a second. Blue's the only one that messes with five. Okay, so let me let me change this a bit. Two, three, four, five, six. Oops. Seven. 
Which ones are messed by which? Blue is the only one that messes with five. Um, one is affected by black and purple. Two is affected by purple and orange. Three is affected by just blue as well. Um, four is affected by black and orange. Six is affected by purple and blue. And sevens by black and orange. So, using this information, I should be able to go black, purple, blue, orange, um, black, purple, orange, one and six. That's weird. Now just two is missing. Click orange. Um, four and seven. So I click black. Now only one should be missing. Well, I can just turn this one off for the time being. Um, that one off. This one. Mm. Uh, I still don't get two here. Whoa, what was that? Um. That's really strange. Uh, hmm. All right, let me think about this more critically. It's been 12 minutes, and I'm already stuck on the second puzzle. Okay, so let's see. They're all off now, which is good. Um, if I click. Let's see here. I'm going to click blue, purple, orange. Um, Purple, black. No. Um, hang on, folks. I will be right back. Okay, um, I think I got it. I just gotta switch it back to all being off. So figure out how to do that. This might take a while, folks. Um, you know what? Maybe if I die, I can restart. Or something. Let's try dying, seeing if death will reset the puzzle. Uh, no, no, it doesn't. Um, I think I know how to solve this puzzle. I just gotta get back to neutral. And I don't remember how to get back to neutral. Um, ah, there we go. Alright, so I think the appropriate order of this is black, purple, orange, black, purple, blue. Wait. Uh, 
No, that doesn't work. One second. Um, I'm just going to try to brute force this. I don't think it's going to work, but... Oh, that's actually really close, but not quite what I wanted. Um, the one thing I know, let's see, that's a four, six, and seven. So if I click this, then if I click orange, only one's on, so I need to click either black or purple. If I click black, 4 and 7 will turn off. 4 and 7 are turned on by orange. Leaving 2 off. So I click purple. Wait. So I click purple, and one and six are off. Um, so if I click blue then, and then black, I can click orange again. Now two, three, and five are off. And click this and this. No, wait, not that. This. Now only one's off again. Ah, uh, boy. Um. Hmm. Uh. Um. If one is off, I can press black, then orange, and now two will be off. With two off, I can press purple, and then black, which will put four, six, and seven off. If I click orange, two and six, if I click purple, I'll go back to where I was, and only black will be on, or and only one will be on. Oh boy. Um, I seem like I get a button privilege or something. So if I press one. Wait a second, what if I... My two's off. I click this, and f two, three, five, and six more off. Oh, that turns them all off. Okay, so wait. Couldn't I just... Did you get that two? Now I'm missing 4 and 7, which orange can do, but it turns off 2. And then I'm back where I started. Or am I? Four, six, and seven. Um Oh. Actually, wait. I wonder. I wonder if I can brute force this a different way. If I press black. This. And this. I 
think I might be able to brute force this a different way. Okay, um... Let's see, can I get just 7 off? This and that. Uh, can I try and four on with um I think I just cheated. Did I get it? Sweet. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it, but that's how I did it. <laughs> um, black, purple, white, blue, orange. Let me write that down. Black, purple, white, blue, orange. Actually, that's an, that's it for this episode. I will be back uh, next episode where we get to the third puzzle.